The commander of Air Mobility Command, General Darren McDo, is visiting airmen around the country within his command. This week, he's been to Maine, New Hampshire, and now Missouri, where he met with airmen from the 139th Airlift Wing in St. Joseph to thank them for their work. So I took command of the Air Mobility Command on the 5th of May, and one of the things I like to do as a commander is to get out and meet airmen and see what they do. And I owe them my appreciation. So that's the primary visit, was to come here and tell airmen how much I appreciate what they do. But he's also learning about the wing's mission and priorities. The general met with wing leadership and civic leaders from the community. I have seen the facilities, and more importantly, I've seen the mission. Uh, I've got a chance to take a good briefing with the mission. I've had a chance to meet the mayor. I've had a chance to meet some of the civic leaders in the community. And so what I've gotten is a greater appreciation for not only how well the mission is accomplished here, but how well the airmen here are supported and their families. One of the special things of the Guard is how they are part of the fabric of a community. We can't lose that either as a nation. The general got a first-hand look at the Advanced Airlift Tactics Training Center, a school that trains pilots of various types of aircraft within Air Mobility Command. A couple of the mission sets here not only support the war effort by putting crews in the fight, they also train crews to operate safely and to deal with any of those things that come up in the flying business that are unforeseen. Reporting from St. Joseph, Missouri, I'm Tech Sergeant Michael Crane.